What's going on guys? Welcome back to a new video. Today I'm opening some of the scariest packs I could find here. Really risking it for the biscuit. We have some big time packs. We have over 50 packs and almost $5,000 worth of value here. So you guys like stuff like this and you want to see more, like the video, subscribe. Those are also the first two steps in our free giveaway for some of this product here. There'll be many winners. All the information in the description and on the screen. And all you got to do uh, for the third step is just follow me on the free Wana app. And then fourth step, just join the live stream when it's time. It's a pretty quick stream. Give stuff away to you guys for free. And uh, yeah, many winners. So best of luck. And uh, yeah, big opening. So we're going to be um, going crazy here, ripping these packs. Here's everything we have here. So uh, we have a lucky envelope. We have some contenders, football, uh, 2019. So we have a mix of sports here. One and one from 2021. Some original year one uh 16 17 optic it is and then some tops from silver packs and jumbo box select select hobby i don't know redemption time maybe we have uh spectra first off the line 2021 and then this year's prism sparkles so went with some of the scariest for various reasons whether it's risky whether it's terrible i don't know we're gonna try and hopefully pull some cool stuff but want to do some scary stuff now this is being posted around the halloween time but not just for halloween just a fun video just for whenever to see hey what do you get from some of these kind of scarier formats that can be very, very risky? So we're just going to rip these, see what we get. That being said, let's get started with some of these. So I'm going to scoot these back a little bit. I kind of want to start with select. I feel like that's one that I would love to give another go. So we'll be flying through these, kind of hopping back and forth, see what we get. Select, you're up first. Let's see if these guys can shed their label of risky, scary, kind of, I don't know, not too great sometimes. Sometimes. All right, so here's the one up first, select hobby. So we have some random packs, some boxes, stuff like that. Just some stuff I could find that would fit the kind of scary billing. So this one, um, this one is certainly one that fits that description. So here we go, select. I'm ready for my base cards. Here we go. So we'll have a lot of cards. I'll move all the base off screen. We'll fly through a lot of base. We have a lot of packs. And that being said, here we go. Come on, select hobby. I would say I believe, but I don't really believe. There's big hits to be found. I've seen a bunch of them being pulled already, but this stuff is is tough. Very, very tough. So here we go. Keon, Johnson, Jimmy Butler. All right. And woo. Scary good, I mean. Woo. Yeah. Duarte. Of course, I, that's one of the better cards I pulled from Hobby yet, so that says something. Here we go, next pack. Maybe halfway through, we'll uh, mix it up. Actually, this is pretty thick here. Maybe halfway through, we'll jump to an optic or something like that. Don't have to go in any order. Just a fun video. And once again, you guys like these videos, you want to see more kind of stuff like this, then uh, let me know. Drop a like, sub, sign up for membership, things like that. Helps do all the content, the giveaways, unique stuff like this, and... Um, yeah, maybe this is scary good in the end. Who knows? There's a thick card here, so... Well, okay. Gotta start somewhere. Here we go. Alright, I'm gonna close my eyes and just see what we have here. I'll try to flip it. You guys to see it first. Is it good? I, I mean... Okay, it's kind of an odd hit. I mean... Not terrible. What, year two? Okoro? Yeah, this is year two. This is not his rookie year. The 25... X Factor, Patch Auto. I have a lot of rookie stuff of his. And that's not exactly too hot right now, but I mean, hey, it's, it's game worn. Actually, I'll take that. I mean, that's a sight for sore eyes. 17 to 25. All right. I mean, hey, all right. That's honestly better than I thought we'd get here today. Let's, uh, after that, let's give it one more go. Didn't disappoint us there. That was a decent pack. But if that's the hit of the box, that's still not great because that's not, it's not a huge card, unfortunately. Every time uh, either of these two guys fall, that's scary. Cat. Collector Cat. Murray. Jared Allen. Okay. All right. Now let's switch. Let's jump into this optic here. And I'm looking at that, that sparkle pack. I think he wants to be opened very soon. I want to chase some obviously superstar Simmons. No, nah, I'm, I'm looking for BI here. That's my guy from this class. Is it? What is this? Okay, okay. Champ is here. Manu. Nice card. Hol oh, I thought I thought that was a, like a blue. I was like, oh, no. It's Jeremy Lamb. Woohoo. There's the Manu. Put it there. It's a cool looking card. Giannis. Year one optic Giannis. I mean, I'm going to put that there. I like collecting the set. 
And um, yeah, should we do one more? Now you know what? Let's 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 jump back in. Do a couple more. Want to hop over to Contender soon, and then I also want to try Prism Choice because well, I don't know why. But I just I really want to see what's inside that one. So Jalen Suggs. And these parallels are driving me nuts. It's a rookie. Whenever I say that, I get a rookie. Not a great one, but Springer. These are the Red Waves, or for those unfamiliar, just kind of the more common parallels that are not numbered, are not really that special, unfortunately, that they love giving you. All right. We might have something here. Silver. Primo. Oh, man. Oh, boy. Yeah. I don't know. That was... um interesting because we didn't find out the kind of full report for like a day and everyone just up in the air like what did he do you know what this is truly a scary opening i'm sorry but you're going here all right select is good they get a break you get to uh think about what you've done here we go let's do some prism and let's do a couple contenders and so select and so far optic Reason why they're scary ones select is uh, it can be scary bad, scary risky, scary price. The optic, going back to those years, a lot of boxes had absolutely nothing. That class is also uh, kind of like that class right here, the football one. Fits the scary billing, which is why that one's in this one here. We're risking it though. We're chasing Danny Dimes. And, and Kyler. Yeah. Yeah, Metcalf. Debo, that is here. It, it's a eh, class. All right, here. All right, hey, working in the front. Here is a uh, prism choice. Let's see if we can get something good. That'd be very nice if we can. Precious Achua, silver on the front. Okay. We have Brogdon. This year's prism was so bad to me, and the card that I've been trying to chase from this set, I still haven't gotten. We have Brogdon. Something here is the autograph. All right, let's see. Uh, oh, that's a little scarier than I thought. The rated R, Kent Benson. Who? With respect, who? I actually have never heard of Kent Benson. Respect the autograph, but that's a first. That's a first. This is a uh, this Halloween special is living up to the billing. Tim Hardaway, oh my goodness. I'm going to have nightmares tonight. All right. Come on. Can we get some rookies? Is a Chua going to be it? And now we know that's not a rookie. Oh boy. That's why I want to do that one. It's the Halloween special. Gotta show some of these. Shea Gilgis Alexander. Okay. Last card. Well, well, well. Boo. Boo. There's our um, parallels. Nice. I'll take my $20 worth of cards and pop them down right here. Nice. Let's do a little bit of contenders. And maybe a little bit of chrome too. want to sprinkle these in. These packs, I'm going to fly through. Because most of them have nothing. Some of them will have an autograph. Most likely one of them will count. Possibly. Odds are... That was also going to be trash. So we're risking it. We're not even risking it for the biscuit. We're just risking it, period. Because the biscuit is not really that sweet and buttery in this product. It's kind of just, you know. No. Here we go, contenders. I'll let them rattle off five. I'll give them five right here to, to prove themselves. All right. That's, uh, I don't think that'll cut it. We have some insert action. And a kid reporter that's long expired. Okay. I said to give him five. If they can do it in five, maybe. I mean, look at the box itself. Yeah, there's like three guys there. Maybe four. What you want. And you get a lot of... In okay, you know what? Actually, maybe there's like four guys. Five guys. There's a lot of oof. A lot of oof. All right. You have three more. They don't have my vote of confidence, but this is not the vote of confidence video. This is the ouch, very scary, don't try at home video. 
Le'Veon Bell, Jets. I almost forgot about that. Yeah. Now he's, uh, now he's boxing. Jets will do that to you. All right. Come on. Are there autographs in here? There's supposed to be autographs, like five or, or six or something like that. Do we, I think we still don't have an autograph. Wow. Greatest choke job of the century. No expectations. And they're... Oh. And they're failing to live up to that. Is that five? This might be five here. Regardless, they need a timeout too. All right. What do we have? We have... Dude. Baker Ma MVP contenders, Baker Mayfield. Oh, yeah. 20, 20, 18, 19. Okay. Maybe. I have a lot of Baker. I was a Baker believer. And keyword there is was. Ouch. All right. Top Chrome Silver Pack. These can be terrible. They can be good too. A lot of surprises. I saw apparently someone pulled a Bryce Harper rookie auto. Great timing on that. And then this pack just destroyed self destruction in my hands. Uh, there's a Wander Franco auto from something that's not this set, which is pretty cool. They mentioned the surprises. I can't open it. And then there's parallels of the, uh, the short print rookies, along with the short print rookies. All right, this pack got destroyed. Okay, this. Yikes. A Halloween tragedy. All right. Uh, I don't know. Okay. Base. Yay. Base. Yay. This also base. Rookie. Okay. So. There we go. All right. One more select. Timeout chair. They state the regret. I think they're ready to go. Can we beat that Okoro? What do you guys think? Can we beat that Okoro? I'm thinking no, sadly enough. I mean, I'd rather have the Bane. Cam Thomas, filler, to be expected, and Trey. At least that's uh, not my PC, but it's special someone's PC. All right. Hmm. Well, I can't say this was unexpected because this is exactly what I expected. This is the reason why these were all chosen. All right, top Chrome. I'm gonna give you guys a couple packs. This is a jumbo box. This stuff, without their, even with their silver packs, can be pretty uh, pretty spooky itself. Get autos, but you're missing a lot of the guys. The price has gone down a lot. And the condition, the bends, all that stuff. Overall, one quite horrific experience. And I have tons of this stuff, so let's rip. All right. Pack one. Is it all stuck together? Most likely. Let's see. Actually, it's not. It's funny, I said that, now it's not. All right. Uh, let's just fly through it and see what we have. Got some rookies. I have like a million of uh, all the rooks, except for Wander, funny enough. And put these guys here. I see something coming up here. I think it's just inserts. There you go. Well. All right, I need to put a little uh, grave in the back. Every pack open, another hundred dollars pops up on the on the thing. There is there a thick card here? Yes, there is. All right, let's see. Do we have something nice here, or is it not nice? All right, uh, 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 I'm looking through. I see something coming up. Goodbye. All right, what do we? I thought I saw something. Maybe I. My eyes playing tricks on me. No, we have something here. All right. I'll put this right here. All right. Here we go. Ivan Castillo. All right. I think I have one of those already. I have every guy you could get on the checklist, except a certain couple guys. Guess down below. I think you guys know. I said to give them what? Three? How about till we don't get an auto from this? If they get another auto here, they can defend. I'll let them defend. That's... Only fair. Oh, there's two thick cards here, I think. Or maybe just one, I don't know. But it'd be only fair to give them a defense. That's the right thing to do. And not like we have anywhere else to go. Alright. Okay. And Freddy 
Peralta. All right, I don't think I have that one yet, but nothing too crazy. Yeah, we opened a lot of Topps Chrome. I opened some cases. I didn't even show you guys the others I've opened. I'll probably do it at some point, maybe in a mail day. I don't know. I'll show you guys all the highlights, all the various stuff. But I guess I did say to continue, but it was... um. Honestly, I should have saved the case for, for today, for this video, because it would have fit right in. I think this is the end of our streak, unfortunately for Topps Chrome. Not unfortunately for us, though. We get to move on. We'll revisit it later. So far, no highlights, though. So, But we do have some sliding stacks of cards. We got Wander, hey, Wander Franco. Didn't think that'd be me today, but it is. Insert. Okay. Let's do, let's do this one Spectra pack. So why is this first team all scary? Well, I had a box I opened to include some of the packs in random hobby packs, and we already pulled the first off the line RPA. Now, Spectra, you can still get RPAs, but the box, we already pulled that kind of guaranteed one. So it's scary kind of, sometimes you go into your shop, you're wondering, has the hit been taken? This would fit that bill if we were in a shop. So let's see. It's the box I bought and used all the other packs so far. And oh, we got some decent stuff. So let's see if we can get anything from here. We have a Nora. Any variations or no? A lot of times, years ago, I go into the LCS and you always wonder Am I uh, chasing nothing here? Brandon Ingram. Has the box been cleaned out or is there hope? All right, here we go. Let's see if this is a uh, trash or super fire. Oh boy. That's not Trumo Kiki, is it? Has he ever been in the zone? All right, well, that is why they made the list. There we go. And, hmm. Let's do uh, an optic. A few more selects. We can give contenders another try because we have no autos out of five packs, which. Those are some special odds right there. Getting no autos. We have some, uh, let that be Brandon Ingram, please. That makes me extremely happy because I have the, no, I have the, the teal and the white sparkle. I was trying to collect the uh, rainbow, but then I gave up. I didn't give up. I put it on the back burner. Scalabus here. Ah. I love this design though. Got the action shots, got the nice border. This year, 299. Yeah, I mean, a lot of purple trolls recently. You seen our uh, 200k opening for 200k subscriber opening? I should specify. Um, yeah, purple, gold. Yeah. All right. Let's do. I'll give contenders. I'll give them three. There has to be an auto in here, right? Select is still sitting here doing nothing. And extra emphasis on doing nothing. They're not helping at all. That Coro might be our best pull yet, though. Which is it? That's pretty sad if it is. All right. So, so far we've taken not one for the team, but more like several for the team, which is my pleasure to do. Hopefully you guys are getting some uh, better luck. Still no autos. And the last time I opened one of these, my autograph was Riley Ridley, I think, right? Yeah, yeah, it was the Bears receiver. Yeah, I think, ooh. Dak. Okay. 175. Hmm. Big disapproval. Come on. It's supposed to be at least five. There's either five or there's six in this year's. I don't remember which one. Let's just say five. But we're through eight packs and we've seen zip. I don't like that. That scares. That definitely scares me. I'll give him one more. Come on. We haven't seen a single autograph. At least let me get that $1 auto. That sticker auto. Come on, right here. Is it auto time? It's auto time. It's auto time. Here we go. Ooh. Oh, boy. Red. 293. Tanner Hudson. What's going on in Tampa right now? There we go. We have an autograph. We're on the board. We are on the board. There we go. All right. And we have Elite QB, Drew Lock. Can I get a bang? All right. Hmm. Select. 
I guess you have to go. Come on, show us something select. Ah, oh, got one of those inserts. Come on. And yeah, oh, what? No way. We have one of those parallels. Man, select hobby. We are due for something. Due for something. Oh, ooh, ouch. Owie. All right. I mean, come on. This got to be something. Is the Okoro it? And the Primo? Nini is laughing at me. Live look at Panini laughing at me. All right, let's see. We have a hit here. Not expecting much. I'm assuming this is a mem. Moses Moody. Moses Moody. All right. There we go. So nice we got him twice. I'm about to say. I was like, no, dude. Triple Warriors pack. All right. You guys all get to go here. I mean, why not? No one else is going to be there. It's an empty spot right now. All right. I'm going to do some chromes. Let's hit the uh, sparkle pack or the envelope. Is someone going to step up today? Now, I purposely chose this lineup, so just uh, stating the obvious, of course. But this is the one time where I was specifically looking for stuff that would be like this, you know? Risky, very uh, scary, something that a lot of us might say never again. But if we're ever going to do it, now's the time. So yeah, these videos um, are very expensive, cost me a ton, so... If you want to see more, keep showing that support, and we can do some more. Hmm. Okay. We'll give him one more after this, but... Yeah, ow. This hurts. Hmm. More of the same. I don't know, Topps Chrome this year for me has been so bad. Historically, Topps Chrome for me has been... Probably one of my worst sets. Funny enough, the other one I was thinking of would be Select Hobby. Hobby. Not for Zephon, Hobby. Here's a thick card. So, two of my... And contenders, actually. So, we have three of my number one flop sets. For me, I've seen the big hits being pulled. Some of you guys. Kind of highlights posted. But, for me, they have been rough, rough. Alright. Come on. Can we get something here, please? Let's see, uh... On a horizontal, Mariners would be nice. No. Jake Jake Berger. Alright. You know what? That's not terrible. I have a lot of Jake Berger. Somehow that's the only guy. That was like our case hit in like both cases. Alright. Yeah. Okay. Jake Berger. What do you guys think? Is he good? What do you guys think? Well. He's not a terrible guy to get. Let them defend. They did get an autograph. I think that might be the hit of the box. Well, at least uh, let's do the envelope next. The envelope can put some numbers up. All right, we have nothing, nothing, nothing. Actually, you know what? Before we do the envelope, I have one more pack I want to do because it's fitting. <gasps> no. All right, here we go. Let's do another silver pack. These, what actually makes these scarier is that they're probably the worst format because, not the worst, but I'd rather have Hobby because Hobby, you get one silver pack. Jumbo, which is double the price, double the contents, kind of like buying two Hobbies, you only still get one pack. So that's kind of rough. A lot of the big chase cards you want are in these packs. So that's a, uh, that's a problem. I never understood that. You didn't get any clarification as to why Jumbo only got just one. And what's up with this formatting? All right. Back here we have Lester and Verlander. Oh, boy. You can tell these two are related. All right, let's do this, this envelope. Mosaic. This one is so risky. Mosaic envelope. You get two cards. And here's a serious question for you guys. What is the riskiest format? Is it envelopes? Is it one and one, which we're still sitting on there right there? Or is it that one? The Prism Sparkle Pack. In my opinion, it's the Sparkle Pack. But I'm curious on your thoughts. Who is the MVP of Risky? All right. Mosaic, one pack, two cards, both numbered to eight. Oh boy. 
the pattern from what I've seen looks kind of cool though for what it's worth so this Malik Beasley is going to hit different this Malik Beasley and uh hmm Chuma Okiki all right let's see first card is actually he's kind of slipping all right well that's not that's not scary at all sign me up whoa like it's a a boom the little ghost and DeAndre Hunter. All right, we got a mellow ball. There's a two of eight. Is this? Oh, eight of eight. All right, all right. Our first uh, big hit of the opening. Lamelo envelope, and I like the background pattern there. Very nice. Makes it more. I don't know. Feels more lucky envelope ish. That's totally a word. Wow. Now that he's no longer in his rookie year, this is a rookie card though from a rookie product. Now we start to pull some Lamelo, of course. Spent. Countless, countless thousands trying to pull him, and uh, now he's starting to show up. A mellow ball. Wow. Did not think that'd be me. If anything, I thought it'd be the back card. Usually the second card. That's the rookie. Not all the time, but sometimes. So there we go. We have uh, our first boom of the break. Here we go. Nice. Dare I give contenders another go? All right. All right. Lamelo. And here's another question. Who's the guy to get from that class now? Is it Mello? Is it Ant? You know, those two guys. But Maxi, Halliburton, Bain, also good players. We had uh, everyone do their rankings in our last Pac-Man Breaks live stream, where pretty much we were just like, hey, who are the top three guys in this class? And we saw some, I'd say, mixed results. I think I still saw a lot of those guys at the top of Mello, Ant, Ant Lamello, and then one of the Tyrese's. But... Something to think about. That doesn't help when is not playing, but, you know. And we have one autograph so far, and we're... All right, here's another one. Flying through the box. Drew Sample. Okay. Uh, Drew Sample. Okay. Two autographs. So far, you know, they get to defend, they got an autograph, they get to defend. That's the rule. Oh boy. Oh boy. Come on. Now, Contender is really all about that one on card auto, which has eluded us so far. And now you can't defend because you failed. But look at that base deck. Do I switch that? That, that is a smart thing to do, but I kind of just want to open another pack of select instead. So when that falls, only my fault. Only me to blame. Here we go. Oh, we have a... What is that? Let's find out. Clay? What color is it? Oh, blue. Oh, I, thought, I saw this and got excited. Drew Holiday. Okay. All right. 249. I mean, numbers, that's good. So we're going to get... Do one more. We have some more chromes. I'm probably saving the one or the sparkle for last. We'll do one of them soon, though. Which one should we do? Let's see. Can this be a rookie, please? No, it's Jalen Brown. I want a ball. Okay. Ooh. That was a... Uh... This is a big risk. It's a big risk. Because I don't want to damage my, my Jalen Brown numbered card. Obviously, I care about it so much that I didn't sleep it. All right. Here we go. I think that burgers, yeah, there, there it goes again. That's probably going to be our our highlight. I'm going to start moving these base cards off the screen because we definitely don't have the room for them. Okay. Yet, yet three. Then we'll do some more optic. We still have another kind of silver pack, which we'll do after maybe these three. Here's another thick card. So far, all base. That's all it's been. Mm -mm, no. I learned. Okay, kind of tough when it's alternating like that, but this time I'm going to be smart. Brandon Marsh. Have a uh, Devers. All right, purple auto. Going to be good. Oh, wait, no. We have Mike Trout. Jake Myers. What are the odds I pulled? 
I only pull the same guys in every sport. It's always never the top guy, but it's like, I mean, one of those. I think I pulled this exact card. Not bad one. Jake Berger, Jake Myers, I'm the Jake puller. There we go. All right, JM, put that work in. All right, he has to defend. He got an autograph, and then once he gets no auto, I mean, the odds of getting another one here I feel like are low, but. Actually, how many are left? Actually, never mind. Not one, because there's only two packs left. Might be right here. In that case, we'll just close it off. Let's see. All right, let's just... Uh, oh, there's Wander Franco. We'll probably just sort this after, because this is getting a little too... Uh, a little too busy. And that was a risky move, but hopefully it pays off. All right. Guriel, where am I going to put these guys? Okay. And... Okay, actually, this is a really good box now. And funny enough, another dupe. I've only pulled dupes, I think, so far. I pulled this exact... So I didn't show you guys the other... I opened a ton of the stuff. I didn't show you guys anything outside that first hobby case because I didn't want to overdo the baseball because you only do so much baseball, don't want to overload it. I want to ease it on, but I've already pulled this autograph. This exact one. Good one to get, one of the top guys. Definitely happy to see it. But, um... Like the Myers, another one that I've already pulled. So only getting dupes, but this is a nice box. Actually, this is... I'm going to put this in a thicker one just, just for now. These autos are a little thicker. Interesting. So Myers, Berger, and Strider. I mean, hey, that's a... I guess a little boom. All right. Let's finish it off. Last pack, Tops Chrome. Then we can take it off the screen. Have a little more breathing room. Okay. There we go. They always deceive you. They got that foam on the bottom. You think there's more packs left? There's not. All right. Oh, what's that? Looks red. Is that red? I don't know. We're going to find out. But I can't complain about this box, honestly. Probably one of the better ones that... Probably the best one I've opened so far, if we're being real. Because I pulled a whole lot of nothing from all my Topps Chrome this year. It's been very bad. It's been the ultimate trick. All right, this trick or is it treat? It is. Eh, I mean, it's vet. Walker Bueller. I pulled his uh, Topps Chrome Rookie Auto. So I have that one, actually. Just a base one. Here we go. All right, our last silver pack. Coming towards the close. Let's open nicely. Let's see if it's good to us. They're all backwards again. And I think I know what we have. We got some backwards nothing. Those are ultimate risk. All right. Nothing but backwards. All right. Let's do an optic. Let's clean through some more contenders. Then we're closing. Hmm? Maybe? No. Wait, I've never seen that card in my life. <laughs> I've opened this stuff. Seriously. Love uh, Jabari Parker. Shout out to him. I don't think I've ever even seen this this guy's rookie before. Maybe I just forgot it, but that's um Yeah, one I forgot. Only a few packs left in here. We were waiting on like three autos, so here goes nothing. We're gonna open three more. Once again, you get to defend, but contenders, man. Why so mean? There's Debo. All right. And there we go. Let's put this there. Debo here. And we'll watch it spin and then fall off. All right. Uh, here we go. Get three. So that's one, two left. We're still waiting on. We have to pull a lot of autos out of just a few packs left. Oh boy. Unless we got shorted, which is definitely a thing. Which would be the classic, the classic trick. Very fitting for this video. If I had to pick a video if that to happen, it would be this one if I had to. Obviously, I prefer not to, but it would fit the theme. Oh boy. Ah oh man, I am, uh, I'm nervous. This is nerve wracking. Three packs. We need to have three autos in these, because we have just two so far, I think. 
I don't like these odds. I don't like them. Here we go. Alright, we have an auto here. Darren Hall. Still no on card guy, and that's the only one you're really looking for. Three base stickers. Okay, okay, okay. That's one. We need to get two out of two. Why does it always come down to this, huh? It always does. Why do I do this, too? I could easily have not done this, but... This uh, stack, it is. Not the opening. The opening I enjoy. I like risking it with you guys. Do some fun content every now and then. It's costly, but it's fun. Alright, we do have an auto here. Is it our on-card auto? Please don't be. Savage? Alright. So we, we have every auto... But our on-card auto, and we have one pack left. So far, nothing of note in this box. One pack. Please. Please don't short us. And please let there be something in here. We're getting the classic 2019 Contenders experience. This is why I picked this box. Oh my goodness, I can't I can't look. It has to be you guys. Here, I'll make sure it's the right way up. Okay, it is. Alright, I think it would be the second card, right? So one... Two, I'm just throwing these base cards right in front of me. I can't see anything. Daryl Henderson. All right. You know what? Actually, out of all the guys, I'll probably take that one. I'll probably take that one. Can we get some uh, some parallel of some sort? That'd be nice. Nope. Just a base on card. Going back in time to try to pull some of these guys. Kyler. Uh, Debo. Danny. DK. Um, can be risky. And it can hurt a lot. And in this case, it hurt a lot. All right. Patrick Willis, and there we go. That concludes Contenders. We have some nice ones to close, though. Right now, we're going to do a Sparkle Pack. If I can pick it up. There we go. Well, can't get worse than... I shouldn't have said that. You know what? I'm, I'm going to say it. Why not? Already down bad. Can't get worse than that. All right. Prison Basketball White Sparkle. Here we go. Malik Beasley. Foreshadowing earlier. Bang. Alright. Our second card is... Can we see some rookie? Dwayne Bacon. Okay. And the third and final card. Can we see rookie? Nets. I love a Cam Thomas. I'd very much love a Cam Thomas. And it's rookie. Dayron Sharp. I'm going to take a rookie all day. I mean, the odds. I mean, not terrible. It's one and, one and two. But hey, we got a rookie. That's all I can ask for. Dayron Sharp. Not bad. Okay. Little, little boom. Okay. We have how many? Four packs left. And then we get to one and one. So far, the most risky formats actually had paid off. We got the Lamello. Then we got the uh, Dayron, which I mean, hasn't paid off, but we could have gotten nothing. So hey, it's a bonus. Nothing bad, not bad at all, actually. Not bad. Oh, blue. Blue, red. Alright. I'll take John Wall. Color match John Wall, might I add. Paul Millsap. Alright. 249. Put that there. Let's alternate back to select. All right, here we go. Uh, backwards card here. Jalen Green, I'll take. Gary Trent, Raptors Silver, I'll take. Isaiah Jackson, Darius Garland. Oh, okay. I'll take that. George Gervin. Take a nice Iceman auto. Honestly, not what I thought we'd get, but... In the picture, he's not exactly in flight. I mean, he's kind of in flight, but... This used to be like dunks. He's an auto. I'll take that. Okay, okay. Now let's see... AJ Hammonds. Can we close off strong with this one? LeBron. And... There we go. All right. So, final pack of select. So far, highlights-wise, 
yeah, I mean, you know, I'm trying to think of what some of our bigger highlights are. If we do our last one, let me see. Do a quick, quick peek. How much is riding on one of one? How much value do we need to get back for one of one? Let's let's find out real quick. All right, Evan Mobley. Yeah, it was the Okoro. The Okoro was apparently our our one. We have Bi. So I mean, a quick look at the stack. I mean, just trying to see about five k. All these. Um, I say we just need to make back. We have the day run. You know, let's see the Strider. Let's just say casual. Uh, I don't know, four k. <laughs> and there you go. Before we get to our final one. Trying to see how, how down bad we are. We are... Yeah. Alright, well... Hey, we know our goal. We just have to do really, really, really well. And Daryl Henderson. Alright. So, the only possible card that would do it at this point, from 1 and 1, would be... Maybe a top rookie downtown. And let me kind of scoot this a little bit to the side so I can grab this. Like a big 1 of 1 RPA. Or a huge timeless moment. Alright. So, here we go, and let me scoot these guys all to the right. So, there we go, move these highlights to the side, and out of curiosity, this card here. This box was, I think, 300-something, and this card is worth, I think, uh, that's a stub one, that's not even the right one. There you go, like, <laughs> not much, not much. So, yeah. That's why we chose some of these products for this video. Let's see if we can make some of that back. That's the center stage app too, for those wondering. I use it, the one I use in all the videos. All right, so give it a look. Might do it for some at the end as well. So about, let's say 4K. 4K we need from this box here. Daryl Henderson. I don't know why, but I had this dream that I was playing at Danny Dimes today. I could just buy one for the same cost as the box too. That's the funny part. Probably less. But here's one and one, our grand finale. 4K. 4K. Easy. All right. Here we go. Our first card from one and one. Let's get this to focus on the box itself. Is. <laughs> All right. I mean, if someone buys this off of me for 2K, then I just need 2K back. So that's a Chris Paul. Phil's wondering. CP0. One off from, from a. Jersey number to 99. Yeah, right? That, that's a huge card. So, I'll put this up. Um, 10,000 OBO. There we go. We'll, we'll cop that one maybe in a bit too. Give it a quick scan. Alright, here's our final card. Please be a timeless moment or um, top RPA or something like that. I don't know, but here we go. Alright. Let's see what this is. Okay. See the head? That looks like Jay Sean Tate. It's Jay Sean Tate to 35. Oh, it's Jersey number. Bang. <laughs> Hold on. Um, let me see if I can pick this one up. All right, let's see. Uh, there's the one to 99 for 56. Uh, tough to see. In conclusion, I mean, there's the one to 10. Went for 285 a while back. A while back. But 45. So let's see. September. Uh, <laughs> so we did not get our 4K back. Yeah, there you go. So this is a good comp right here. This one sold for um for about 50 bucks. 50 bucks. 50 bucks. So there we go. That's uh that's our standard stage app, which I use a lot to get our comps. Those asking for some value in some of these. Um it was very fitting for the theme. Very fitting for the theme. I was gonna scan this one. Give me like two dollars, two dollars, maybe three dollars. <laughs> I would cop that at. Here's the highlight stack. But this was the theme of the video. Risking it for the biscuit, the scariest packs, and they were scary. I purposely chose some of the riskiest underperforming packs we could find. And we uh we tried our best. We tried our best. So here we go. Here's everything we got. And let's find some of our highlights. Jake Myers, I mean, Strider, Dayron Sharp, White Sparkle. We got some booms, but Got a lot of busts. Gervin, I like that. I'll pick just a few for the highlight stack. Um, Lamelo probably our our number one there. 
to eight. Jake Berger. Cool name for what's worth. Jay Sean Tate, man. Oh, man. Woo. All right. If you want to see one of these again next year, yeah, drop a like, sub, and um, another spooky opening. I'm having nightmares tonight. Here we go. Put these here. And these two guys. Well, there we go. Our scariest opening to date, literally and figuratively, but we did get at least some some big stuff and some nice stuff. Most of them missed. Most of them, we risked it. Didn't come close to the biscuit. Don't even know what it looks like. But uh, there we go. We did get the mellow, which is a nice, nice card there. And that was a lot of fun. So I enjoyed doing it. Every now and then we go kind of crazy and try to risk it for the biscuit and hopefully pull some cool stuff. And we actually did. Um, had a lot of fun. And some of these were, were they were fun. They're very tough. So that being said, I enjoy these. And if you guys like them too, make sure you drop a like, subscribe, and stay tuned for a lot more content like this. We'll have some more. And uh, yeah, it's a lot of fun opening these uh, risky packs. So maybe next time we'll do the most giving packs, maybe for Christmas, something like that. But that does it, guys. As always, thank you for watching. Enter the giveaway once again. Win some free stuff for yourself. And uh, appreciate all you watching. Until next video, I'll see you later.